What's up fellow hobbyists? What's up fellow hobbyists? This is Dato Ogis Tagulilong from SRAC channel, Sports and Hobbies Edition. And we are very excited to inform you that our package has arrived! It's a big ass box! Big shout out to Sir June Alawigan for hooking us up with this big ass truck! In this episode, we are going to unbox and review the Rofel Racing or commonly known as Roman RC, Roman LT, 320. If you want to know how big it is, the camera does not give equal justice to how big this is. So if you want to know how big it is, my opinion is, ha -ha! So we are going to unbox and review another 5th scale RC gasser. Rawr! So are you ready? So are you ready? Am I ready? Let's go! the Kraken RC Vecta.5 uh, I was so overwhelmed that I wasn't able to uh, make an unboxing video so bear with us this is our first um, unboxing video for our second fixed scale RC First, this is the Fly Sky GT3B. This will be our transmitter. We will be going to review this in depth further in the next episode. For now, I'm just, I'm just gonna show you so, bind plug, instruction, manual will be our mixing jug. 20 is to 1, 25 is to 1, 50 is to 1. Mixing jug has a panel, will be installed like this for easy transfer of the control. Instruction manual, instruction manual, the charger, I think this is the charger, yes, this is the charger, with the Tamiya plug because it uses a uh, little metal hydride. We have wrench, Allen wrenches, we have Allen wrenches, wrench, tire wrench, spark plug wrench. This is the extension for the battery towards the receiver. And then we will go to take a look at the instruction manual. Seems like they use a high grade quality paper. So we will go over this manual. Very important to remember that always read your manual so that you'll be able to use that knowledge when you're sitting in your car. Take a six. Bunch of six sheets. I don't know if you're going to use this. But take a six. It is big as truck. I think it's a lot bigger than the desktop. We're going to remove the truck to the box so that we can see it uh, on an angle. That is one big ass truck. Okay, so here's the what's inside the Rovan Rovan LD320. So this is the receiver box. Let's take a look. Now there's the receiver box. So it has a metal servo horn with a big servo for steering servo. This is the center drive shaft. This is the throttle servo horn and the big digital servo from Rowan. Uh, the, the part number is RS2145D. Now this is the chrome pipe. This is a clone of Bartolone, I think. It's a rubber piece, connecting rubber piece. This is the chrome, chrome pipe all the way towards here and it is attached by a bracket holding the pipe 
So this is the CY. I think this is a CY engine. Let, let me check. Uh, so I think this is a CY engine. This is a 32cc engine. CY engine. And this is his um, filter. The filter is not oiled. Now, the carburetor and a plastic block. This is his um, clutch holder. Uh, it's good that the, 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 it is covered. It's good that it is covered. The center drive shaft. The center drive shaft, I think this is metal. Yes, yes, I think this is metal. And this is metal. And this is the two brake system. If the servo will move going there, the, the brake system will engage and the wheels will not move. So this is the center post. This is the 800cc. I think this is the 800cc um, gas tank. It has a, this is a metal, this is met, aluminum. Aluminum body with oil plastic side panel. For the price, it is thick body, center body, metal center body. This is the rear bumper. This is a big ash shock as well. And it has a metal center brace, a shock brace tower, metal shock brace tower. Also, it is fitted with a rubber boot. This is the battery box. We will take a look at the battery box. This this is how you charge the battery that is needed for the servo. And also the pipe has a bracket connected to the engine to secure it properly. So that is our uh, Rofan nickel meter hydride 4500 mA 6 volts battery. So this is our center drive shaft. The center drive shaft is connected to the drive shaft front drive shaft and rear drive shaft if you can see uh, the rear drive shaft and center drive shaft has a rubber boot to protect from dust uh, we have a spark to plug I think if we can remove this oh my goodness uh, so we just replace this spark plug for NGK Also, uh, the pull start handle is the ergonomic type, so it fits your hand comfortably. Now, let's go to the front. So, the front has a light holder, so in case you will upgrade for lights. We have a metal turn buckle and upper drive links. Also, a big drive shaft. That's the tire. If we are going to compare the Kraken RC Vecta 0.5 tire to the Rovan LT320 tire. Uh, it seems like they are almost the same, uh, the same diameter. We have a uh, plastic lower arm and still upper links. Servo saber. So That's our walkthrough to our Rovan RC, Rovan RC 320. So that's that for our walkthrough video. Subscribe, stay tuned for the breaking video for this monster. Subscribe if you want to know more about this truck, please comment it down below. Subscribe and hope that you will share this video so that many, many others will be able to see, might be able to see this video and might be inspired getting a fifth scale Gasser RC. Subscribe, so don't forget to like, Comment and share, and if you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe, you better be! <laughs> and also, hit that notification bell, so that you will be able to see new content on this channel. So again, we're gonna keep it short and simple. This has been Dato Gista Gulilong for SRHC Channel, Sports and Hobbies Edition. This is the fifth scale edition. <laughs> Talk about his check.